Ja. Hey guys, welcome back. We're gonna talk about how we've mic'd up the whole drum kit when we've tracked the upcoming album. And then there might be a little blast beat here and there, maybe a little double foot pattern. Maybe there will be a hellish ride on the ride, yo. But before we get to it, check out this amazing merch. So yeah, let's get started. Here we have the drum set and we're gonna start with the hi-hat mic. This is an AKG 1000S. So next will be the classical Shure SM57 going on there. And on the bottom a Sennheiser E906. Next will be another pair of Sennheisers for the toms. Even on the on the floor tom, since they are pretty much indestroyable. And we have another AKG CS1000S on the right bell. And a pair of matched MXL 603S for the overheads. And last but not least, uh, Shure Beta 91A. As you've seen, there's not too much to high pricey microphones going on there. We've used some solid ones, but uh, affordable, I would say, affordable. So yeah, you can go crazy with condenser mics, but if you have a drummer, like I fortunately have, who's capable of hitting hard and good on it, shitty old drum sets that you put in front of him, then these microphones will do, do the job and you will surely get a great material to work with. So talking about hitting hard and good, let's have a look at how recording drums looks from the perspective of a drummer, shall we? You're gonna first hear the sound of the drum kit when he was playing it and then I'm gonna blend in and out the processed sound so you have a feeling of how far you can get with this affordable, let's say it, affordable microphones that we've used. <laughs> Didn't I tell you this would sound great? I did. And I was right. With this pretty solid medium budget equipment and a capable drummer, you get pretty decent material to work with. So you don't have to do that much of getting rid of errors and shitty sounds from the mics and can get instead right into processing them into this big 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 roomy boomy 
sound that uh, as kicking metal drums need. So the next time we're gonna talk about vocals. I'm gonna show you material of how we track them, how filming maybe a little cringy passages of singled metal screams. I mean, they sound great in the album, but everybody knows that you look a little retarded doing them soloed. So this is gonna be interesting on the one way or the other. I mean, I'm looking forward. <laughs> So yeah, see you on this next, on your next, on your next hangover. I mean, I know you guys getting shit faced listening to heavy metal on the weekend and then laying lazy on the couch watching this shit. So yeah, see you on the next Sunday. Bye. <laughs>